Yeah. So um, B Events, it's a it's a it's a mobile app uh, which uh, can show you the um, the first collectible things, and second, uh, you can find the concert, the exhibition, the any other um, uh, things around, uh, like let's say like uh, like this kind of um, projects. And the yeah and the and the, and, the, and the be in the culture yeah like we want to show the culture to the normal people yeah because this kind of um, event right here is pretty hard to get here yeah like uh, you get to know someone or you get to be an artist or you get to know the, some artist or it's it's pretty hard yeah and and to to take people on from the street uh, we need we need a we need a some kind of uh, media. Uh, which is right now medias are on the smartphones uh, and um, yeah and uh, uh, there's gonna be a of course a lot of um, I would say that um, like uh, challenges and uh, and the collectibles and um, yeah like um, I would say that uh, you can create the any event like uh, for example, uh, we we're thinking that uh, right now uh, the mm, boomers, the the generation of sixties, uh, seventies, eighties, uh, they are very uh, they have anxiety. They they stressed about the kids because they always have a connection about the phone. Yeah, like uh, they always can like uh, if if the kid doesn't doesn't answer the phone one hour. They are very stressed, like ah, oh, he's dying. He's he's probably you know he's kidnapped or something like that. And uh, with B, uh, of course you you got to uh, put your connection uh, into the into the uh, into the into your phone. So <clears throat> kids can let's say create the event uh, that they're gonna play uh, soccer, and there's a uh, eleven spots like in the Counter Strike or any game. And uh, there's 11 players, let's say Thursday on uh, 6 p.m. And uh, if somebody wants to play, he can go there. Uh, if, if somebody gonna change the plans, uh, the, the spot is, is empty and somebody can go there. And the parents gonna see that um, the kids who are with, where are they exactly? And uh, they, they're gonna have the, let's say, protection for a, for a, for a for their um, uh, pupils, and um, yeah, uh, uh, we want to also like. Um, I, I, I'm not sure. Did, did you ever been in a in a in a in a some kind of Facebook groups like uh, spotted uh, spotted um, I don't know Poznan or uh, spot, spotted Tokyo or something like that? Uh, there is a people who really uh putting the post like uh i want to go for a beer with someone anyone like uh i, I i'm looking for friends like I'm, I'm new in the city i moved here from uh osaka and uh i want to go for a beer with, with a stranger or play pool at the billard yeah or uh i want for me uh i discovered that uh where i was on the malta and i was searching for a player to tennis yeah and uh, like uh, I put the Thursday uh, 3 p.m. and uh, people say like, oh, I cannot in a Thursday, maybe for Friday. Oh, I can, but uh, not on the 5 p.m. on the 3 p.m. And it, it was very hard. I, I spent like two or three hours of my life, and um, you know, like uh, time is the is the is the most precious uh, currency that we have. Yeah. And I'm spending like two or three hours to find uh, the player to tennis, yeah. And uh, um, and here uh, you're just creating the event, and uh, someone who likes the tennis gonna see that uh, by the algorithm uh, creating in a, in a Python, yeah. That's the language of uh, machine learning and uh, and uh, let's say AI, yeah. It's not exactly AI, but people start to call it AI. Um, yeah, like um. Here I'm just gonna show you. I, I think this is pretty uh, like this is how how, how you create the the your uh, account. 
uh, here we have the event uh, with the, let's say, um, church is open just two hours in, the, in a week and you can go there. Uh, here is the description, here is the map, and uh, this is important, um, like a big concert. Uh, here is some friends and stuff. And here um, you got the trophies. Let's say uh, you go uh, 10 times on a marathon, you got the trophy. And uh, you can show that on your profile, uh, yeah? Because uh, we are um, trying to uh, get people, like people are on the screen, yeah? They are like uh, TikTok or uh, Facebook or uh, Instagram. They want you to be on a screen as long as it's possible because you're gonna see a lot of ads, a lot of commercials. And you, they want to be, uh, they, they, they want you to be on the screen as long as possible. We are making two steps back in our nature, and uh, you, you're gonna be on the screen just like five, ten minutes, and go and see, smell the people, touch the hand, see, like feel the emotions, see the real person, not the video, not the, not the, not the zoom, but real person. So. Um, that's our mission to, to make us two steps back in our nature because I think that uh, the, 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 the software and the, and the smartphones are the great adventure and, uh, and, and this is a big discovery but um, how the, 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 the Silicon Valley is, is using it it's not the best idea that they may have so um, I think our nature is um, more, uh, we don't, I'm saying about me, yeah, like, uh, and, and, and my community, we don't want to be uh, in, the, in, the, in the metaverse, yeah, we don't want to get, have a Googles and, oh, hello, how is it going, how is it going, okay, I'm going to shoot to the zombies for, like, an hour or two, but I'm, I'm still bored, yeah, like, I, I don't feel... It's, it's it's very boring, yeah. And, and and spending time with the real people, it's it's a real life. Uh, okay, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm um, I'm ending. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. I'm waiting. Um, uh, this is my partner, uh, Pavel Krug. He's a software engineer, and he's a. Uh, chief of, uh, of a technical um, uh, project. This is me uh, two years ago, so I was uh, more pretty than right now. Um, here we got um, uh, Patrick, and uh, here we got uh, David. Uh, David is a very good musician, by the way. Uh, he also makes music, and, uh, and, and he's very good, good in our social marketing. Um, yeah, this is our partners and this is a B. So, um, you've got a match, it's uh, the best, like, uh, um, it's some, so, some people saying that it's a little bit like a Tinder, yeah? Like, uh, you can go to the, like, play chess, and uh, is it gonna be a girl or a guy? It's random. So, uh, you can meet the person and have a love, uh, fall in love in someone real, not in the TikTok, not in the Facebook, but real. So this is our goal and this is our future. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much. Do we have any questions from the audience? Okay, then I have one. Uh, yes, sure. Uh, so uh, I think some of us know, already heard about how uh, the NFTs, much like uh, cryptocurrencies, have a catastrophic influence on the environment. Yes. Do you think that 10% uh, of your uh, income from the, the NFTs will offset the damage to the environment um, and to the deeds that the yes. NFT will make? That, that's a very nice question. Um, uh, the, the biggest catastrophic um, on the environment have uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum. Uh, we are using Polygon, which is way much, uh, uh, using way much less energy to create it. And uh, we are using Polygon to be more um, 
a zero waste uh, and you know like uh, mm, good to the good, good to the planet and uh, zero waste has to do with physical waste, not much of electrical. Uh, yeah, yeah, but zero waste. Uh, I'm saying about the graphic cards which are used on to make a bitcoin and uh, put it to the trash. Yeah, right. so so we are trying to uh, we are using polygon. And uh, if there's going to be a cheaper and easier cryptocurrency, that might be even a point. Not, maybe that's not going to be exactly on, maybe that's going to be on a blockchain or not, but that's going to be the easiest uh, possible uh, software which is, uh, which is going to be on the market or we're going to create uh, some, we got one German uh, partner who know how to create the cryptocurrency which is going to be cheaper. Right now we're using Polygon, which is way much uh, less um, danger to the environment than Bitcoin and uh, Ethereum. But don't you think that entering this market anyway, even if you personally are uh, using uh, less uh, destructive cryptocurrency, yes. still will fuel, it, fuel the crypto market? Um, I think that there is a bigger... Uh, uh, the bigger the destruction destructive companies in the world than the cryptocurrencies yeah like uh, you know uh, let's say um, uh, I don't know like uh, you know the gas in Russia the the war in Ukraine and stuff yeah like uh, cryptocurrencies probably gonna be the future yeah so um, if uh, I'm not a big fan of the Bitcoin uh, Ethereum try to be easier and to, to code and uh, yeah I think um, it is gonna be more popular uh, but um, this is we are talking right now yeah and uh, the future we are not sure how it's gonna be in the future yeah so so we, we, we hope that the future is gonna give us the answers to 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 um, to create uh, to create uh, the best solution which is possible. Okay, thank you. Yeah. And we are now out of time, thank so you. we will move on to. Um, I'm just gonna sit here so that there's no hear me better. Okay, so thank you very much. That was Robin Andrasinkowski with his presentation. Mm -hmm. And now I would like to welcome Dr. Thomas Kovella, Teresa Chapandova, and Jan Melena with their presentation, Pathfinder in Australia. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah